Dear students, let us continue our learning the course data structures and applications. We are in the 10th session of the module 4. The topics covered under this session are application of trees, that is evaluation of expression. Myself, Dr. Suresh Adi from the Department of Computer Science and Engineering of Kendra Engineering College, Bantwal, Mangalore. First, expression trees. So first, let me take one simple expression, then we go for constructing the tree. Let me take the expression as a 3 plus, the expression is a 3 plus, 3 plus, then the parenthesis 5 plus 9, then the multiplication with the 2, then closing this one. So for Constructing the expression tree, first we need to go with our board mass rules, what we have learnt in the earlier classes, that is first lower priority will be the plus and the minus, then the higher priority will be the star and the divided by, and the next highest priority will be the parenthesis. First we have to solve the things which are in the parenthesis, then next we need to take up the star and the divided by, then next we have to take up the plus and the minus. Then under that one again, if I have the two stars over there, 3 star 4 star 5, if this is my case, so in this case, I need to take up 3 star 4, that is this we call it as the associativity over there, that is if the operators are there at the same priority or the precedence, then we go with the associativity. The associativity for these operators is the left associative. Left associative means the operator on the left side is to be evaluated first before we going for the next operator. So now let us use these rules and let us construct the expression over here. Now I need to solve this. This is my innermost parenthesis. This is to be solved first. First the operator I will write it as a root and the operands will be written as the it's a leaf. 5 and the 9. So the one which is on the left side is to be connected as a left children and the, the one operand on the right side is to be connected as a right children. Then the next, one more level of parenthesis. What we have inside a star 2. For the star we have the two operands, one on the left side. What is this one on the left side? The result of this operation. What is the result of this operation? 5 plus 9 which is equal to 14. That is the operand, that is the first operand. Which, that is on which side of the star? that is on the left side of the star, that is on the left side of the star, I need to take this entire thing, I need to take this entire thing as the first operand on the left of the star. Next, on the right of it, the second operand, what is our second operand? Here yeah, the second operand is 2, 2 will be connected on the second operand. The next one is a 3 plus, so now plus is the next level of operand. So now that plus is a 2 operand, 1 is on the left side, what is there on the left side? That is 3, that is my left child. Then the second one is on the, the result of this one, the result of this one, this entire thing result, the result will be your right operand. This is how we construct the expression trace. This is how we construct the expression trace. So let me take some other tree, let that tree be. 2 plus 3, put the parenthesis, star 4 minus 2. Now I need to construct the tree now. So now this is the first parenthesis which is to be solved first. How to solve it? First plus on the left side I should have the 2 and on the right side I should have the 3. Next, this is to be solved. What is that one? Minus on the left side I need to solve 4 and on the right side I need to have 2. Now the result of these two are to be multiplied. What is that one? Star. So this is one tree. This is my other tree. I need to connect them. I need to connect. The one on the left side as a left side. The one on the right side as a right side. This is how we construct the expression. 
this is how we construct the expression trees so now when the expression trees are constructed now let us go with your formal description that is expression tree is a binary tree expression tree is a binary tree what are the possible for the expressions either i can have a single operand or the operands can be an unique one operand can be no children at all or if it is a binary operand we can have the two children left operand and the right operand that's why it is a binary tree in which each internal node represents a operator internal node is the operator and the leaf node responds to an operand fine and this is the equivalent tree so now what is that one 5 plus 9 which is to be solved first 5 plus 9 then it is to be multiplied with the 2 next level next the entire thing is to be added with the 3 3 plus but one thing you should remember that on the left of the you have to follow the same order that is 3 is on the left of the plus that is 3 is to be connected as a left child this entire thing is to be on the right child now for the plus second plus 5 should be on the left side 9 should be on the right side for the star plus the result should be on the left side and 2 is to be on the right side this order you have to retain this order you have to retain then the in order traversal in order traversal of the expression produces the infix expression pre order traversal the post pre uh, prefix expression and the post order traverse get the post fix expression let us go with the in order traversal what is the in order traversal first left 3 then the root plus then the right again left again left that is 5 then the root plus then the right 9 so left side we have done then the root star then the right that is 2 so this is your in order traversal pre order traversal first root plus then the left 3 then the right then the right that is the star again the left plus again you are left 5 again the right 9 so now this part is done then the right right of the star what is the right of the star 2 so this is your pre order traversal then the post order traversal post order traversal first will be the left 3 then the you are right again left again left that is 5 again right 9 left right uh, the done then the root plus then the left done go to the right 2 then the root star then the left right done then the root that is plus so this is your post order traversal that is a in order traversal of the expression tree will give the infix expression pre order traversal of the expression tree will give the prefix expression post order traversal of the expression tree will give the post fix expression now if i go for this is how we construct the expression and this is how we traverse the expression then the next one how we go for solving the expression how we go for solving the expression for solving the expression we go with the post order notation how the post order notation first solve the fine so first let me write the post order notation over here first will be the 3 then next will be the 5 then next is the 9 then next is the plus then next is the 2 then next is the star then next is the plus this is my post order notation right so how we will do is so whenever we have the operands we are going to push it to the stack 3 push it to the stack next one so now this is done but the next one 5 push it to the stack next one 9 push it to the stack next one plus when i get an operator you pop two entities from the stack pop these two so now when i pop these two and perform this operation plus what is the plus operation what we popped 5 and the 9 perform the operation what i get the result 14 that value you push it to the stack again next operand 2 push it to the stack again next star pop two entries from the stack what are the two entries 14 and the other one is the 2 so now multiply these two what is the value 28 so now pop these two in place of it you put the 28 next plus 28 plus 3 now plus means again pop these two 28 plus 3 31 31 is my final
so that is evaluating the post fix expression will be nothing but the your x, x evaluating the expression tree that is we use the post order traversal for the evaluation of the trees how it will be done let us look with the function if t be a expression tree if t is not null if t is a value that is operand then you give that value or else if it is a operator then take its left side and the right side then you are going to solve take its left side right side solve it then go to the your root fine it is nothing but you are similar to that of your post fix expression fine how we will do that one if the character is a operand then push it to the stack if we get an operator then pop two values from the stack what we have done earlier pop two values from the stack you solve it then the result you push it to the stack again push the current node again this will be repeated till the your expression becomes finished once your expression become finished whatever it is there in the top of the stack that is your result this is how we go for evaluating the expression the references for this presentation are taken from the textbook ellis oravis and sartasani fundamentals of data structures in c second edition university press 2014 and uh, data structures from the sham outline series written by semer lepters revised first edition tata micro 2014 thank you